ask our assemblywoman, Fiona Ma, to come up and speak. She has introduced AB 1000 that talks about this issue. And so this is one of the things that, again, we're so fortunate to have somebody that's in the assembly that's looking out for working people. And so again, I'd like to introduce our assemblywoman, Fiona Ma. As I was driving over here on the freeway, there's this huge billboard right before you turn off that says stop H1N1. And it reminds me that we are in the middle of flu season and the H1N1 epidemic. And we don't know when another epidemic is going to hit. And therefore, it is so important that when people are sick, they are allowed to stay home to recover. Because yes. nobody wins when workers go to work sick. Yeah. Yet, nearly 6 million California workers today, or 40% of the workforce, cannot stay home if they are sick. What does that say about our country? What does it say about our economy, about our businesses, when people who are sick cannot stay home to rest and recover? It does not promote healthy workplaces. It does not increase morale. It does not help in terms of customer satisfaction when people are getting sick at workplaces. Workers and customers, that is no good for our economy. And so I propose AB 1000 that allows workers to earn one hour for every 30 hours worked. For large companies over 10, large companies over 10 employees, workers can take up to nine sick days for themselves and their family members and if they are victims of domestic violence or assault. We believe that this is fair and necessary. If they work for a small company under 10 employees, Workers can earn up to five sick days to care for themselves and their families. We feel this is so urgent. This is a public safety matter. This will help address the health crisis that we are facing today and ensure a productive, healthy economy. It's good for workers. It's good for employers. Thank you very much. Now that's what we're talking about. We're talking about the assembly working with working people, families, going out there, proposing legislation that is going to help families. And again, you see this backdrop. We're here in front of this Walmart store to talk about serious issues. And again, Assemblywoman Ma, we thank you. We thank you for that. Next up, I'd like to ask 